Hello, welcome to the ETF Super Pit Hit, brought to you by OptionMonster.com. I'm Noah Warsaw, a DPM with Group One Trading. I sincerely apologize for my for my absence from the show yesterday, but as you know, things were pretty crazy down here. I could not take volatility curves up fast enough. People were buying everything in the, across the board, and FXE was getting crushed. Like I told you the day before, when we saw that risk reversal trade in Jan 2010 with the buyer of put and seller of call. Obviously, sovereign debt issues in Europe continue to be a great concern. Greek was, Greece was downgraded to junk yesterday and Portugal was downgraded today, which is why the market sold off from its high of about up seven spoo handles to where it is now at about unchanged. This morning when we saw the rally, we saw a trade take place in EEM, iShares Emerging Markets. The June 3741 put spread came in. Paper sold it 9,800 times for 94 cents. After the market sold off, that thing's trading a dollar or two now. So where I come from, that's called uh, roughly an $80,000 loser. So wear it, whoever sold that. Uh, they were trying to capitalize on a volatility spike that they saw from yesterday and thought vol would come in. But we're seeing the VIX stabilize now and the market continue to sell off. Um, other than that, uh, continuing the theme, uh, volatility buyers across the board, FXI, very active, which is China, uh, the Xinhua 25. Other names, of course, include the financial leverage products, UIG and SKF. So a lot of volatility buyers still, and uh, where the VIX is going to go from here is anybody's guess. Uh, will the issues in Europe continue to be pervasive and cause this market to sell off, or are we going to continue to see the same bull market we've seen for the last 13 months? Time will tell. If I knew, I'd be on a jet, but best of luck on you to you for solving that riddle.